Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Merry Christmas. I hope everybody had a great Christmas, holiday season. Um, I know it's different for a lot of people this year, um, so I hope you guys are able to enjoy it and make the most out of it. My Christmas was great. Um, I got to spend Christmas Eve with my family. We did Christmas Day with Ryan's family. Um, so it was the first time that we celebrated Christmas. So it was really nice and different. Um, but today I'm going to be sharing what I got for Christmas. Normally I do one of these videos every year and I was a little hesitant on doing it. Um, just because I know this year has been really, you know, hard on a lot of people. Um, so I didn't want it to come off as like, just showing you guys what I got. Uh, but I did do a poll and a lot of you said you wanted to see. So I figured, you know, since you guys wanted it, I'm going to go ahead and share it. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on all my social media, uh, my blog. I am very consistent on this platform, so make sure to check them out. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay, so I've um, got a lot of great things this year. I'm going to start with things that I got myself. Um, I don't know about you guys, but every year I like to say, you know, or I'm not like to say, but I like to get myself something nice. This year especially, I know, was a very hard year, but I still had so many great blessings. I mean, I got married, um, my business is doing really well, which of course isn't thanks to you guys. So I wanted to treat myself to a few little things, um, and I'm gonna start with those first. Okay, so first things first, um, I did get the new iPhone um, 12 Pro Max. I obviously use my phone for my business so this is not only a great gift to myself um, but it's also amazing for my business I absolutely love it I have it right here so I got it in black um, and then I have this really cute loopy case on it. it has this like black leopard print to it which I love um, but yeah this phone is great it's definitely different I had the iPhone 8 plus so this is a big upgrade for me um, and very much obsessed with it so recommend this one if you're looking to upgrade the next thing i got myself i have wanted for a very long time um and i never picked it up but for black friday it went on sale so i got it for myself and that is the jaclyn hill palette so i'm sure you guys are very familiar with the palette it's been out for a while it's so great um here's what it looks like i have already played with some of these um i used it for christmas eve such a great palette has so many really nice eyeshadows and this is just a nice one to always have um, and travel with because it literally has every color you would need so I definitely am in love with this and I can't wait to keep creating more looks with it the next thing that I got for myself was something just very basic and cozy because it's been actually pretty cold here in Texas for you know a few days I think today is the warmest it's been in a while but I think after today it's supposed to get cold. Um, but anyways, on to the gift. I got myself this nice little pink blanket. I still haven't unrolled it. It's by Opal House at Target, and it was only like $10, I think. I thought this was such a great little gift. It came in so many colors. I, of course, went with pink because it will be sitting on my pink chair in my office. But I just thought it was so cute and great, and so got myself this. And the last thing I got myself was such a splurge, but it was something I have been wanting for a very long time, and I decided to go for it because I found them at a really good price. And that is a pair of Jimmy Choo pumps. So for a while I had gone back and forth between if I should get some Jimmy, Jimmy Choo's or Louboutins. But most people who have Louboutins say they're pretty uncomfortable. So I wanted to have a shoe that I knew that I can always grab that was easy. So everyone recommended the Jimmy Choo's and guys they're so beautiful. So they're nothing outrageous. Like no sort of crazy shoe. They're just like a normal nude pump. But again, it was just something I had been wanting since I graduated college. I wanted to get some nice pumps. So this is what they look like. I have already worn them. I wore them for Christmas Eve. And they're just so pretty. Such a great classic staple that I'm so happy to have in my closet. Um, I found them on the Outnet. If you guys don't know about that website, definitely check it out. Uh, I believe it is like um, Netta Porter's like overstock of luxury items so check them out that's where i got these i want to say it i got them cyber monday and they were um already on sale 
then I got them for an additional 20% off, so they came out to under $200. I want to say they're like $160. Um, so they're really inexpensive. You guys look these up, they're normally about $600. So these were such a great deal, and I was so happy that I was able to get myself a pair. Um, and yeah. The next few gifts are gonna be from um, cousins and uncles and aunts, so I'll just go ahead and get started. Uh, the first thing is this Sarah Jessica Parker set. Um, I got it from my uncle. It was such a nice little set, so it's like a perfume and body spray set. Um, I like having extra fragrances that I can take with me when I travel and stuff. I think both of these make um, great sizes for that. And then I can have just like the spray for the gym. So both will be very much used, and thank you to my uncle for this. The next thing is from one of my cousins. He got me these silicone wine glasses, and I absolutely love the color. These are gonna be great for the summer. Um, and then along with that, he got me this Stella Rosa Red Apple. I love the Stella Rosa wine collection. If you guys haven't tried it and you're 21 and up, I highly recommend it. Um, they have really good ones. I think this is a holiday one, so I'm really excited to open this up and get into it. Okay, so I also got this from another uncle. They're these European hazelnut chocolates. Pretty sure these are from Costco. Costco has great, great holiday gifts, especially in their food. So I can't wait to try these. I also got these Italian truffles, so it's different truffles, um, from an aunt of mine. So plenty of chocolate this holiday season and cannot wait to open these up. Okay, so this is from another cousin of mine. They got this like hot cocoa set. Obviously, like I said, with the weather being so cold, hot cocoa is in high demand right now, so I'm very excited. It has a bunch of different flavors, so I'm super excited to try this. And with this gift he got, he got me this really cute Margaritaville Margarita gift set. So it comes with the mix and some really cute glasses, and you guys know I love margaritas, so I cannot wait to open this guy up. And thank you so much to my cousin for getting us this. Last little thing I wanted to share that I got from my family um, was this little sign. My cousin actually made this, and she's so talented. I told her she has high skills for craft things, because I cannot. Um, but I thought it was really cute, and since we just moved into our new place, and spring is around the corner, this is gonna be the perfect thing to hang up outside our door, so I'm really excited to use this. Thank you. Okay, so next I'm gonna move on to gifts I got from Ryan's family. Got a lot of really good things and super excited to use everything. The first thing is from his brother and his sister-in-law. Um, I had asked for this little facial steamer. I'm sure you guys have seen these all over social media. And I just thought, what a great way to give yourself an at-home spa day. So really wanted one of these and they delivered and I'm so excited to use this so thank you guys so much and along with that I got these really cute like drop earrings these will go great with so many outfits they're gold which you guys know I love wearing gold jewelry so they are perfect next thing I got were from Ryan's aunt one of Ryan's aunts and they are these leggings um, they look and feel really great they do have these like pockets on them you can never have enough leggings, so these look really nice. Thank you so much for these. You guys know I got a, a record player last year and Ryan's aunt was so nice to get me two records I really wanted. Um, this one, of course, is Lizzo and this one is Casey Musgraves. I haven't opened them yet, but I'm super excited. Um, my record player is still in its box, but I need to get it out because I want to listen to these so bad. Um, but again, thank you so much for these. Okay, the next gift is really special and really cute. Um, it is from Ryan's sister's boyfriend, and he got us this really sweet little canvas print um, that is a picture of us from our wedding day. It has our wedding day on it, um, and then, of course, it says love, and it says love down here, so it is really cute. Um, it came with this little stand that I need to put together so that you can just stand it up. Um, and I'm sure you guys can see that bookshelf behind me. I have a bunch of Christmas things on it right now, but once I take that down, this will definitely go there, and it's so cute. I cannot wait to display this. Thank you so much. Also from Ryan's sister and her boyfriend, we got this really pretty candle. The colors absolutely match everything in my house, which makes me so happy. Um, and it is a vanilla and chai scent. It smells so good, it's huge. Um, but this is such a pretty candle, so thank you guys for this. I know I'm gonna get so much use out of it. I also got these really cozy and cute socks from Ryan's sister. And the last thing she got me is so cute. It's another custom item. Um, I need to get a frame for it ASAP. And it is this like illustration print that says the Hannah's 
and it's me and Ryan and Bubbles. We actually took these pictures last Christmas, but how adorable is this? I can't wait to hang this up, it's so cute. I actually wanted something like this, which I, what I, which is what I had told her, um, but I never got it, and I'm so glad I have one now. It is so cute. Look at Bubbles with her little scarf. Such a sweet gift. I think this is like such a unique idea. Highly recommend if you need to get someone a gift. These are so cute. So again, thank you so much to Ryan's sister. Okay, so the last gift from Ryan's family, it's from his parents. It is this like mini fridge, which is going to be used for my skincare. I absolutely cannot wait to set this up. So another thing I'm sure you guys saw all year were these cute little skincare refrigerators. Um, it's to preserve your masks and just keep them nice and cool so when they hit your face, it's just like literally a spa day. Um, so this one is a nice little pink one. It matches like the pink that you kind of see on the outside. Um, it's, I'm not going to pull it out, but I'll show you guys the color. You can see that it's a nice little pink fridge. Um, I'm going to set this up ASAP and put it in there so I can get all my masks in there and I can have a really relaxing spa day with my nice cool mask and my steamer. So thank you so much to Ryan's parents for this little fridge. Okay, so moving on, uh, the next few gifts are from my parents and of course my mom always gets it right so I'm super excited to share with you guys what she got me. So to start, she got me this little skincare set by Mario Badescu. I love mini skincare sets because they're so great to travel with. She also got me these um, pillow cases that are allergy, um, I guess for people who have allergies, yeah, they have like an allergy defense fabric. I have horrible allergies and my mom obviously knows this about me. So these are gonna be so great. She also got me this like friends packet of socks. Comes with a bunch of different socks. You guys know I love friends. And I haven't opened it yet, but I'm super excited to open it. It has like four higher socks and then eight low cut socks. I love socks. And then she did get me a few things for the kitchen, starting with these really cute Mickey Mouse Christmas oven mitts. If you guys remember from my videos, you know my mom always gets me something Mickey Mouse for the holiday season or Disney for the holiday season. This year it's these cute little mitts, which is so great because I don't have any kitchen uh, Christmas kitchen mitts. So these are perfect. She also got me these really cute salad fork and spoon set. It has Mickey Mouse on the ends. Um, again, I love Mickey Mouse, so this is such a great little gift. Plus, we don't have a salad fork and spoon set, and we didn't put it in our wedding registry, so this was a definite must. She did also get us a little like um, meal station by Black & Decker. It ha it's like a sandwich maker, a grill, and a waffle maker. Um, I don't have it on me, but she did get us that, which is such a great little tool to have in the kitchen. And then last but not least, she got me this really cute Mickey Mouse sweatshirt. It is so, so cute. I love it. It has a bunch of little messages around it, and of course, Mickey in the middle. You really cannot go wrong with Mickey Mouse things for me for the holiday season. Two last little things for my mom, and she really just nailed it with these. They're little ornaments. This one is a little bike that says... 2020 and it's decorated with little roses and on the other side it says just Mary how adorable is that oh my god so I'm super excited to have this obviously it symbolizes our wedding year and we will have this ornament for years to come she also got us this other one um, these little like precious moments characters and they're just like holiday and cutesy and they're so adorable so I cannot wait to have these on my tree for the rest of our lives, we'll have these little ornaments. So again, thank you, mom. These are so cute. Everything was so cute. You did so great. Okay, coming down to the last few gifts here. Um, so the last gifts that I got are all from Ryan. Um, he got me some really great gifts and really excited to use them all. <laughs> Okay, so the first thing he got me is this Bruno Mars 24 Karat Magic album. I love, love this album so much by Bruno Mars. We both do. So it's really a gift for both of us. Um, but it's such a great album. I have it on vinyl. Again, I have all my other vinyls now, so I need to set up my record player so I can start listening to these. But this is such a great gift. I've been wanting it for so long. I also got this little brown duffel from Ryan. I got a brown duffel from him, I want to say like two years ago for my birthday. 
um, but it fell apart, so he replaced it this year and got me another one. Um, I think I like this one better, to be honest. Um, it doesn't feel as big, but it definitely feels better quality, and it has this little like luggage tag on it, which is great, and you have the strap. So it's just a nice bag to travel with if we're just going away for a weekend. Like I can use this instead of using uh, my little carry-on bag. So next thing is from Majuri, and I'm sure you guys have seen them. Also on social media, they have some great uh, jewelry pieces. There's a few I really wanted, and Ryan was able to get one of them for me. And it is this really cute little ring. Um, so I'll just put it on so you guys can see. So it's this one right here. Um, I just think it's a nice ring to kind of make its own statement, even though it's just like an old band. It's just such a great ring to make a statement, and it was something I really wanted, so I'm super excited to have it and to add it into my jewelry collection. And then the last thing I got from Ryan is a Nespresso. So this is just the box. We already have it all set up. But you guys, so far, it is so great. I have made um, an espresso with it, and Ryan had made a coffee, like a decaf coffee with it. You can just tell the difference. I mean, the espresso was really strong, but it is obviously an espresso, but it's just so great. It came with the little milk frother, um, and the machine is like black. The espresso uh, coloring, or like the wording, is in like a rose gold. It's so pretty. Um, so I'm so excited to have this. I will take you guys along my coffee journey. Just follow me on Instagram. Um, but seriously, best gift ever. All right, and that concludes my what I got for Christmas. Again, such a blessed year um, with everything that has gone on. Like I know it's been a tough one, but you know, being resilient is, I think, the key to life. So. It was a tough one, but such a great one overall. I am beyond ready for the new year, and I cannot wait to see what's in store for me. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and let me know down below what was it that you got for Christmas, or what was your favorite thing about the holiday season um, this year. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!